Um, but that being said, welcome guys. Great to have you here for the new season uh, of North Star. We're getting a new operator. Um, that's called uh, Thunderbird. Did not mean to go to that. And uh, today what we're going to do is we're going to check out some of the tiers that they have and uh, what will come in the bundle. So obviously like every other season, they're going to get some free stuff. But if you get the premium battle pass, which I believe is uh, 1,200 credits for the basic minimum. And then I think it's 2,400 credits if you want, I think, the first 25 uh, tiers done. Anyways, if you get the premium, you automatically get this scan right here for Thunderbird. And you unlock her two uh, weeks early. If you don't get the premium battle pass chat, you're going to have to wait two weeks to get her. But uh, I liked it. I equipped it instantly. Uh, but let's go ahead. Let's go through this real quickly and see what else they have to offer. Is it worth it? Is it not? I haven't looked at it, but we'll see together. So they're coming with a fighter jet weapon skin for uh, Frost's gun, which is not bad, but I've seen better. Level two is a uh, is a flare gun, which there was a video as soon as you click on the battle pass that that's why there's that it mentions it. An ash gun, ooh, this one actually looks really cool. So this is I have black ice for this chat, but this is something I actually probably would switch up because it's got like a little flare to it uh, to make it kind of like a little unique and cool. I like that. I dig it. Booster, a rare free. 120 R6 credits. If I remember correctly, you get uh, about 800 R6 credits from this anyway. So you're getting back two thirds of it if you buy it. Uh, this is attachment skin for I think Tanish. And unfortunately, what I've started to notice right away is uh, if it loads, they're going to be doing more of the ocular scales kind of stuff from last season, which I personally don't like. It doesn't look great to me. Uh, they all look like frogs, but that's my my honest personal opinion. So, come on, little yeah. So it's more of this, unfortunately. So we might skip past some of that stuff, uh, and it looks like a lot of these uh, charms are going to be more located towards the uh, story that they shoot out for uh, people. You know, before you obviously get in here. So this is our first legendary, which is only tier 10. That's for Frost. Okay. Usually they have her face kind of hidden a little bit. Some alpha packs. This is Frost's legendary. And I have to say, this is really cool. Um, I know they announced earlier on that they were kind of looking forward to, like, if you get the elite skin, you could still attach other skins and still get the elite animation at the end. So if that's what they're still trying to do, this will be kind of cool to have also, uh, besides the legendary skin. We got Thermite with his frog headgear as well. Yeah. Chonka with a snake skin. Free charm. IQ, okay, this one actually looks kind of decently good too. I like this. A little messy bun. I, I mean, I. I've been playing this since Operation Health, and so this is kind of interesting and, and cool, Chad, that they're switching from, like, cover up all their face to kind of trying to take away from that, where they're trying to give it more of just the bare, the bare face. I like that they're not hiding it. Ooh, Northern Lights for Buck. I like that. It's a cool skin. I like it. I have her legendary, uh, kind of like retro stream punk. That's not her lead skin. Some alpha packs, more alpha packs. We got a thing for Jackal, which is probably the frog skin as well. We got the shotgun. Not, I like the yellow, but not very impressive. It's just very, it's like standard basic. We got a Thunderbird uh, alpha at 23 for free. I didn't know she was Native American. That, like that's the origin they were going for. So I think it's really cool that they're introducing this and kind of keeping uh, to that style. Oh no. Oh no. Yana, you don't have a lot going for you, girl, and they're doing this to you. Oh. I. <laughs> Shaved head with weird looking mohawk. Maybe some people call that style. I. I, I don't. <laughs> but man. <laughs> no, that looks bad. 
Uh, we got a buck with a trail seeker, but this is only a rare. Why does that kind of like him. the hair looks wonky as it moves? I don't know what that is, but uh, I kind of like the the. See, this is what I imagined for his elite skin, like this beard. I get they're trying to go for like a frozen effect. It looked make him look like he was a lot older. Uh, this one I, I like a lot better. Okay. That's kind of cool. Ranger's keys. I dig this one. Um, the sweater underneath is a little bright, but I like the the whole bags and, and everything like that. Very kind of camouflage looking style. Look what they did to my boy Flores. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Uh, so it looks like most of the, the alpha packs especially if they're like the free tier are gonna be rare uh maybe you'll get an epic i don't think you'll get any legendaries unless it's like right here a legendary uh and that's but that's in the premium got a more north american jet looks half decent it sounds like some of the stuff is gonna be kind of plain based style um i feel like it's plain style but that, that's not bad the uh for uh for this gun i like it the willing pilot interesting i like it and i don't like it just something about it doesn't feel completely right or smooth but it's different graceful resource awareness okay i i like that a little bit i feel like it's a little bit less bright i personally don't love the bright colors um if i'm just playing casual or something like that sure but if i'm playing ranked i don't really want really love bright colors because i feel like it gives you away way too easy um, not bad. Dechonka. Maybe show this. There we go. Look how they massacred my boy. A Valley Energy Bar. <laughs> I like that. I, okay, well, I dig it. It's stupid, but I like it. Uh, no. <clears throat> that was kind of cool, too. I dig that. I like that. A climbing helmet. Orcs, did they do this well, or did they? Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. It hides his horn, though, chat. That's why we call him Rhino, okay? He's got the nice little horn, and they hit it with the helmet. But I still like it. <clears throat> Thermite. They gotta get off the frog armor, chat. I don't love the frog. Okay, actually, this one looks really cool. That's, that's pretty nifty. I like that. Who the frick says nifty? What the frick is this? Capcan. Oh, Capcan. I love you. Look at this. Oh, it is beautiful. As a Capcan May myself, this needs to be unlocked. And at 49, we'll definitely get that. <clears throat> Ooh. Yo, Jaeger's getting a freaking ballistic knife. <laughs> Look at that. I dig that. I love the attachment kind of style of the things that they're doing. I mean, obviously, it doesn't affect your. Uh, it's not going to get you better kills or anything like that, but, you know, it shows that they're trying to do something unique and different. Smart six credits. Safety patrol. Not very impressive. Why are the guns, like, halfway off the screen? <clears throat> they didn't. They didn't focus on, on that um, spacing. That's a rat. That's just a whole rat as a charm. And that's a legendary somehow. All right. <clears throat> Tega Crossing Bandit. Ooh. Davy Crockett. I like it. <clears throat> Jackal. Yeah, there's next to it. <clears throat> Air Medical Services not bad kind of sleek smooth i like it not too flashy but also not too stand out ish which you know <clears throat> you want it to be a feel you a little unique you know you don't want everybody to run the same skins unless it's like last season's uh seasonal skin that one's really good okay kind of like it <clears throat> this looks cool that looks cool to chunk okay. this is like the very first one i mean i don't love the patterns because obviously it looks like a frog but the headgear alone this is for tachanka this looks beautiful i love that i like it i dig it 
Canadian chopper. Very bright, but decent. I needed a new headgear for uh, Nomad, so uh, I'm loving this. <clears throat> this looks very good, though. I feel like they shaped her a little bit after Mira. Just a little bit. We're at 70. Another snakeskin. Rescue Ranger. Rescue Ranger. Bend down. Mud caked. Oh boy. Thatcher. <laughs> I'm going to go take a shower, brother. <laughs> Said yet his hair is stylish. I like it. Bear Bell. Say that ten times. Bear bell, 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 bell. I can't say it. Nope. Chat, if you can say bear bell ten times fast, tell me in the comments. Because I can't. <laughs> Yana. Poor Yana. Okay. Ah, okay. I don't know if I like this headgear or not. It, it's a little too big. Uh, but maybe equipped with the body, it looks a lot better. I don't know. Forest Essentials. Rescue Mountain Canyon with four Oryx. I like that. That's oh, that's really good. <clears throat> I dig that. Emergency Chopper for Nomad. Hey, it's, you know, that's the really cool guns can too. I like that. Really good. Got Ella's Absorbent Headband. They dyed her hair again. Can't keep her hair color for is she just crying for attention chat dying your hair constantly I, uh, I dig it though i like it we got a duck the great northern diver uh, legendary snake skin for uh black beard and flores marks and rifle this i have heard uh oh wait this is not it yet but this is the attachment skins for a vigil which probably will show in any second. <clears throat> okay, I dig that. I mean, the, <laughs> the Muppet headgear kind of ruins it. <laughs> but if you can ignore the Muppet headgear, <laughs> the body looks decently good. <laughs> oh, no. Ooh. Let's take a quicker look at this one. <clears throat> or closer. A little panther, it looks like. Or bobcat, maybe. I don't really know my, uh, my different types of cats. I take it. Someone's gonna be in the comments like, Zapuma. <clears throat> a wooden whistle, okay. Jekyll's got uh, his head gear. I swear I thought we already got with this one. Well, this one's actually not bad. It actually kind of fits him a little bit. <clears throat> Search and rescue attachment skin. Okay, going for the blue effect. Oh, you guys actually, okay. So if you get up to 96, you'll get a, a legendary alpha pack in the free. This one's the one I know a lot of people were talking about. This is the uh, Autumn Longbow for Vigil, and it legit actually looks like a kind of a, a bow, a crossbow, actually. So it'd be. But uh, this looks looks really cool. I have to say that. I don't really use Vigil, but <clears throat> very impressive. You get a snake skin for Yana and Nomad. You get Frosted Moss with a Nook, which. Yeah, I dig it. I, I just got the freaking uh, medieval one. And now I'm going to keep myself in the teeth for that because this one looks kind of cool too. <clears throat> and the outfit's actually pretty decently cool too. I like that. That's actually really cool. Search and rescue. This is the... Oh, this is a uh, seasonal skin as well. Um. Yeah, no, I don't really fancy this too much. I like the, the, the one you can buy with the snake skin. Or with the snake emblem. <clears throat> and then, oh, here's a little cool thing that you're adding this uh, season. If you uh, complete your battle pass, every 5-1 afterwards, you can get an uncommon, rare, epic, or legendary alpha pack uh, after every 5 tiers. So that's kind of a nice way to say, hey, you did all that we asked, and you want to keep playing, and put time in, then we'll give you some more alpha packs, which I think is uh, super awesome. So there's that. Uh, real quickly, we went through the battle pass. Hopefully you guys saw something you enjoy. And uh, real quickly as well. Oh, I, okay, I can't do it now. But uh, they made a lot of different changes as well. Uh, for quality of lives, the loadouts, and um, the scoring, and uh, death replay, and whatnot. Um, 
they did not institute cameras after you die, like moving and whatnot. That they said they're gonna do in a later patch. So look out for that. Uh, Mira and uh, Maestro got a nerf that can break their shields as well. And uh, obviously we've got a new operator that can heal people. And if I remember correctly, Finca also got uh, buffed. Buffed. If it's over 100 health, you get the extra 20, and then it'll go away. But if it's under 100 health, you get that extra 20, and it stays permanently after the Finca boost is done. So some of the little interesting little facts and changes that they did to the season, and I'm excited. I hope you guys are. Uh, let me know below in the comments what you guys thought was the best tier or skin that you guys saw. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.